Yeah, playing golf in the combo. Playing golf in the combo. Welcome back to your boy's channel. You know who it is, it's Duff. I got a special guest with me now. I got my guy Travis from PGA Memes. What's going on the, everybody? The funniest golf account, the funniest account out there. This is my guy right here. So look, we are at Cotton Bowl Golf Club right now, sponsored by Sweden's Cove. Sweden's Cove is a, a new whiskey, I think out of Tennessee, uh, that is basically ran by Peyton Manning, Andy Roddy. You guys know who those two are. Right now, Peyton Manning isn't here because, uh, as you can see, the weather is atrocious right now in Dallas. Worst weather in Dallas in like five years. The, I mean, uh, yeah, I, I have, I've been in Dallas. I moved out of Dallas in 2018. I don't even think it ever rained like this when I was here. It's May, it's like 55 degrees, pouring down rain. But look, we are in the Cotton Bowl. They set it up really dope. They have like a par three going on. Yeah, we got nine holes here, par three contest out on the course. So it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be fun. It's cold, it's wet. We might get a little wet today. I might shank a couple. Shanks happen. Shanks happen sometimes. You yeah, know, so, <laughs> hey, it's gonna be fun. We got Andy Roddick, we got PJ Means, we got Gary Clark, we got everybody here. We're about to do it big. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so here's the situation. We're out at the Cotton Bowl. We're playing three holes. I think we're doing a closest to the tent, right? Yes. We can't go down on the field and putt. It's raining, whatever. So, I mean, we're going to each hit, let's just say, like three shots, maybe four or five shots. What do we say? I mean, I feel like we need more than one shot for the closest to the tent. I think it's so wet outside that my grip, I might not be able to close my club. So I think I need a couple shots. All right, let's do it. We'll, uh, we'll hit like three shots, closest to the tent. We're playing three holes. But most importantly, let's let's get the cameras over to this man right here, the man of the hour. This is Andy Roddick right now. Heck yeah, man. How are you guys? Thanks for being here. Yeah, of course. What's understood does not need to be explained. This is a legend, Hall of Famer right now, tennis legend, Austin native. This is the guy right here. This is why we're here right now. I'm celebrating his whiskey, which is Sweden's Cold. Yes, sir. Um, and that's it. I'm not gonna say anything else. All of, uh, unfortunately, all of those things that you just said doesn't mean I can hit it any closer than anyone else in the pen. So we'll, we'll, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> We're gonna have a good time out here, guys. Let's get it. Three holes, close to the pen. <laughs> those are so consistent. That's it. Wait. All right, Andy. So we just got our warm up in. Yeah. Now we're gonna go three balls closest to the pin. Yeah. How you feeling? I don't feel good. I'm uh, I'm consistent, but consistently like 40 yards right of it. The, the 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 wet soggy range ball isn't really turning right to left much. So I, uh, I I'm definitely not the Vegas favorite at this point. Hey, the conditions out are really tough out here. <laughs> it's really cold. It's it's raining cats and dogs. It's a monsoon out here. The winds are going this way and that way, that way and this way. So okay, so we're on to the actual challenge. Which is uh, we each get three balls. I'm hitting eight iron. You got a seven. Seven. seven iron. I like the yeah, like it. Um, do I just same order? I'll go first. Closest to the pin wins this hole. I think we're playing three different holes. So let's go. I was waiting for the bounce. I was waiting for the bounce. It went in the bleachers. Oh. 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 I like that. That looks good, D. Oh. It's still long. No, you in the weight room, bro. I'm swinging easy, I think. You're in the weight room, bro. I'm swinging easy.
did come down the grass. How far did you get down? 7 iron? Yeah, but how far is that? Like 185. Wow. Alright, I don't know what to do out here. Um, we're in a tornado. Like, we're in a monsoon. I haven't seen weather like this since the 1930s. I read about it in my history class. Alright, I'm gonna ch I'm gonna change it up a little bit. I'm actually gonna go with the six iron. Everybody's been hitting it pretty high. I'm gonna try and punch a low one in there. Oh, oh shit. I think that's gonna be the closest. All right, so we got we hitting three, baby. So Andy's up now. Let's see what he has. Oh! Oh! He did. oh, my oh <laughs> he might have did it. So I see three. We see three balls, right? Mine. I think I think y'all might need to do a tiebreaker. I, I feel like us three are yeah, almost yeah. the let's, same. Let's way. all hit one and do a tiebreaker. Let's all hit one shot. One right. shot. One I shot. think it's all one shot right now. Tiebreaker. I like it. All right. So me, Grant, and Andy are currently all about the same distance. So we got to do a tiebreaker here to see who gets the dub. Yeah. If it wasn't raining, we should probably yeah, have someone out there with a tape measure, but we're eyeballing it all day. Alright, Garrett's up. Oh, turn! That's gonna be at the tree. Look short. Right, that's short. I don't think that's gonna cut it. I think I think you do what you keep doing, what you've been doing, bro. No, but I hit two draws and the I last think, one was a little. I think you're thinking too much now, Andy. Lefady. You're thinking too much. Now, Story of my bro. life. <laughs> <laughs> like you didn't say nothing about that earlier. Now you're like, hey, should we draw this? Or well, no. Straight? But the last one, I hit a little fady one. I want to know. I want to know if that one cleared the trees. Is what I want to know. Yeah. Ooh. That looks. That's it. Ooh. That's, the club twirl. That chicken dinner. Oh. Did we just get a club twirl? Like right over the pin, but it was good. Shot. It, it's just this shot, so our previous shots don't matter. Right, right. Oh, where? You're in between the draw and the cut. I think Grant got the dub. I think Grant got the third. Dude, why are you always holding? Hey, first fall. Let's go for another hole. So let's talk about Sweden's Cove a little bit, man. Yeah. I've been hearing about it. Um, I have a buddy of mine named Larry Fitzgerald who said he had an opportunity to have been, <laughs> and he missed out on it. He told me about that. So talk to us a little bit about the, uh, is it a whiskey or a bourbon? Uh, both. Uh, yeah, so uh, if it's of a, above a certain proof level, it becomes uh, bourbon. So it's a Tennessee bourbon. Okay. Um, our first release was last year uh, in uh, Tennessee and Georgia. Uh, we're making the ambitious move into, into our great state of Texas. Yep. Uh, this year, things have uh, gone pretty well. Um, you know, it was, we were pretty lucky. It came off of, uh, it came on the heels of uh, buying a golf course where they had a tradition on the first hole at Sweden's Cove where you would bring a, bring a shot of whiskey as we're kicking in music. Obviously. Right now, yeah. But uh, <laughs> you'd basically take a shot on the first hole. 
uh, and then you would leave a bottle for the groups behind you. So it was, it was kind of a sharing mechanism, which, yeah, yeah. which created a cool kind of sense of culture. So. And, and from that, we said, are we dumb enough to actually try to make our own? Yeah. And, and we were. Um, and, and your boy Larry thought we might have been a little dumb with it too. Um, <laughs> but I love, I got a lot of love for Larry. Uh, but anyway, so uh, our, we have a master blender named Miran Eves, who's the uh -huh. first uh, woman designated master blender uh, in Kentucky since Prohibition started. Okay, go. And she ended up growing up, uh, she's Tennessee based also. We bring in uh, a guy you might have heard of, Peyton Manning, who yeah. is also uh, kind of big in Tennessee. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. And so uh, everything kind of just fit and, uh, you know, uh, the demand far outpaced uh, the supply last year, which is kind of what you want. Um, um, got a little bit of hype around it, so uh, we're trying. Yes, sir. Yeah. I got my blue cheese ranch finder right now, getting it right. One twenty-three. Ooh. That's oh, right be on. good. That's right on it. Oh. Ooh. oh. I'm good. Whoa. I'm not gonna hit the second. Tiebreaker? Yep, you two. Sure, for sure. One shot each. To be fair, I still have two more in my first turn. What? Just go ahead and hit your two if you get inside. I think I can get a close up now, but. Oh, oh, did he do it? Oh, oh, he might have done it. Oh, oh, oh. That's so Bryce and Andy are pretty much the yeah, same. Yeah, that's no tiebreaker. I only hit two inside of yours. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Bryce and Andy are around the same spot, so they're going to do a tiebreaker. It's not that bad. You're okay. <laughs> are you in the circle? That's a great miss. Are you in the circle? That's a great miss. Well, I'm in the winner circle. I'm in the winner circle. Let's go. Let's go. I didn't even hit it in the circle. I feel like absolutely that's two tiebreaker losses for me. That, that's two. I mean, he got two balls and I got two balls. And I'll say that's a tie. I see. I'd say Andy's pretty dialed right now with the wedges. Okay, he's a monster when it comes to the wedge game. Oh. The confidence was different when I saw him over there versus what I saw right there was a guy that just stepped up to the plate <laughs> and delivered a service ace, okay? Guys, we're on to the last, last hole, last right. close to 10. 130 yards. <laughs> Dude, you just got so close out of nowhere. 130 yards here, guys. Back to the maroon flag. I just want to hit some good shots. Andy's impressing me. That's what I'm saying. Like, like he, he was sandbagging. He was saying he, he doesn't know how to control his golf swing yeah. at the beginning, talking all this, and then he gets up here. Dead straight, every day. Dead straight, money. You're good, you're good. I mean, look at this. Playing draw something. Yeah, I would never want to But I mean, up. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's so consistent. Oh, oh that's on the line. Uh, is it tennis rules or golf rules? Sandbagger. Sandbagger. That was close. We came. We 
got rained on and we conquered. The Sweetens Cove Cotton Bowl Golf Club Classic <laughs> held by my man Andy Roddick and my invisible man Peyton Manning yeah. who would be right here, would be standing about right here with a very big head. <laughs> Um, yells a lot though. Yells a lot. Like, he he'd be lot. yelling a bunch of random stuff like Omaha, Omaha, Omaha. Omaha. He does that all the time. Omaha. Um, but we had a great time. Uh, tough conditions out here. Andy hit some good shots. I didn't hit any good shots. I'm the, not the very double good. G's. I like to say double G's. Matching the shirts here. Oh, yeah. I love it. GG. Yeah. Double G's here. Hit some great shots in there. This is what they do. This is not what we do. <laughs> we just like to laugh and have a good time. So shout out to all you guys for tuning in. Yeah, I think surprisingly though, like he was sandbagging because he was the most consistent the whole time. Oh yeah. Like you hit like what two bad shots? I, I mean, it's tough to sandbag. We didn't even throw out numbers of what we are. What? Yeah, like, no, well, you, you got sandbag. There, you can't got sandbag nothing. You got up there and you said I can't even control my golf swing, no, and then well, all of a sudden everything's going dead. No, it was, it was a tight draw every single time. <laughs> I, think, I think the funniest moment though with Andy was over there on the first hole on the back side of it when he was had to hit his tiebreaker he was like should i hit a straight shot should i hit a cut should i hit a draw i was like no just hit what you've been hitting yeah <laughs> so. there was a there was an episode of analysis paralysis there for a second but <laughs> yeah we had a great time andy thanks for having us guys, out, man. Yeah. i it appreciate you guys you, yeah. great being yeah. with you guys yes, thanks for coming out sorry yes, about the weather no, no, good. Good. anyways hope you guys enjoy this video until next time peace